Hey guys, and welcome back to uh, Countdown Vampires. In the last video, we made some progress. We found a video tape that we printed a file from. Yes, and I know magnetic uh, storage medium has been used in servers and old systems for a very long time, but it still perplexes me uh, quite a lot. But we did find another one. Uh, so if I can remember where exactly we went to get that printed, I I'm pretty sure I do. Let's go do that. Unless we have to find like a separate monitor for every single one of these, which would be complete pants. Uh, let's have a look. I mean, I'm sure it's just going to be guff like we got in the last, uh, last piece because that last file said... Something about they're filming a, a, a film in, in the sea, and the sea is the background, and they're filming the location. Uh, basically, we, you know, the files in this game are a load of old, you know, rectum. But, hey, you never know. Maybe we shall find one as gripping as The Keeper's Diary. And whilst this game is loading, I'm going to do the only reasonable thing. I'm going to crack open a bottle of Old Empire IPA. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Ale. Right, anyway. Um, now. There was a save room here, wasn't there? Oh, what was that? Did we even see this? Oh, more nine millis. Uh, yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, cool. Oh, it's right next to the map as well. God damn it. I can't believe I just, like, missed some 9mm ammo. Uh, sure. I think it was up here somewhere, wasn't it? Ale. Oh, my God. You know, that's so crisp. Mm. Yes. Ale is life. All right. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's back here. Uh, I don't think the save rooms are marked on the map unless they are the white dots hmm oh god that's refreshing yeah i'm sorry but i can't slay vampires uh, without ale you know it's just not gonna happen although you know apart from the times where it does happen which is the majority of the times so uh, i guess that whole line of dialogue was completely redundant right here we go so yeah uh, i'm guessing if we go into the map yeah, so those white dots, I guess, are the save station item box things. Which, actually, that, that's quite useful. I would have rather the game actually highlighted them properly. But what are you going to do? File acquired. Looks like a castle. Movie is being filmed of the castle being the setting. The scenery is being filmed. Yeah, I mean, these are just us. A movie is being filmed with the castle as the setting. The scenery is being filmed. I apologize. I've wasted your time and mine. Okay. So we got a key. Uh, it was the uh, attraction key, I believe. Uh, not really sh I don't remember ever finding a door to an attraction, I don't think. I could have forgotten. In fact, it's very likely that I forgot. I can't remember if I uh, said this in the last video as well, but my Switch Lite came back from Nintendo being repaired, and uh, I'm a happy boy. Because I can now take my Switch Lite back to work and play my Switch Lite in bed. Because I love the Switch. It's such a, a shit-hot handheld. Um, the only thing I will say about it Mr. Nintendo. Oh, hello. Uh, gun work, please. Oh, oh, no, 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 that's, you know what, fuck this guy. Fuck you in particular. Didn't act, oh god, there's loads of them. There's always loads of them. Uh. Arse cakes. Big, gribbly arse cakes. Also, they're a, really... Their attack pattern is he What? How many is there? How many is there? Are you serious? There's like seven... What the f... Alright. 
Okay. We're gonna go down, aren't we? We're reloading. We're reloading. We're we're running. We're we're really badly injured. Do we have any health? Uh, we have an empty bottle because I'm a stupid bastard who. Oh god. Right. Fine. Oh, this is gonna be gribbly. You know those. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Uh, so the good news is, with the power of safe states, uh, the good, uh, oh yeah, we've got to go get the file again, haven't we? Well, that's fine, because we've got to go back that way anyway. Uh, right. So yeah, as I was saying, uh, Nintendo, if you are listening, when you say the Switch, I'm talking about the standard normal Switch, and the bloody chaos kitties have got in here again, is portable. You're not really being 100% honest there, are you? Because the Switch is not really that portable. It's a big boy. It's a very big boy. Uh, taking it to work, I have this armoured case for it, and it has this Ziploc case that it also goes into and all that kind of stuff. It takes up the overwhelming majority of my, my work bag. So I'm looking at you, Nintendo, trying to say that the Switch is a portable... I think you're really pushing the definition of a portable there. I mean, sure, it's portable in the sense that, you know, you could take it with you whilst you go and have a shit, but it's not really portable. The Switch Lite, that fits the bill rather well. Anyway, I wouldn't really want a system bigger than the Switch Lite. I thought the Vita was pushing things, and the Switch Lite is significantly bigger than that. And then you get the big boy switch, and oh boy, oh she's a big boy. She she's a she's a big yeah. Let's go with that. She is a, a, a very big boy. Uh, right. Let's go print that film out again. Don't worry, we're not going to get dependent on save states. That was just uh, that was where I started the video. I am only going to be save stating at the end of videos. I also had a brain, um, a big brain, if you will. I could probably use save states to completely balk and get us a load of money. I don't know if I want to do that. I mean, this is a game that we're just playing for funsies. I don't really give too much of a shit about it, uh, you know. But I, I'm, I don't know. I think that might be a little bit of a step too far. We seem to have a good amount of money anyway. And yeah, I'm really going to have to get rid of my Chaos Kitties. Cats. Seriously. Lads. Chaps. Dudes. Why must it be... Sorry, I'm Likes to be dead weight when he knows he's going out. Wouldn't mind, but we've already had half an hour of playtime today. Okay. Now. Let's go. So, we need to go sort out all those vampires. Ooh. Uh, that's quite a lot of vampires. Like, seriously, that is a lot. Yeah, not sure if I want to cheese the game by using save states to win us loads of money. Uh, I don't know how... Given the random nature of, of the games, actually, I'm thinking about it, I don't know if you realistically could. You could probably make it easier uh, to cheese, to get money. But, uh, yeah, yeah, thinking about it. Oh, God. Thinking about it. There's still an awful lot of randomness to the games. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Oh, he's touching me inappropriately. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, this doesn't... This doesn't work very well. <laughs> this really doesn't work very well. Alright, let's cream up these boys. That sounds bad. But then there's no real way of... Saying that without it sounding bad, to be honest. Uh, what are we doing ammo-wise? Yeah. Not bad, I suppose. There is a... I was going to say, we could go back for a health item. These guys... Yeah, okay. There we go. I was going to say... Oh, fuck! I mean, you can't even tell where these guys are. Unlike Resident Evil, you, you kind of know where the zombies are. You can hear how close they are to the edge and stuff like that. But these guys don't make any sound. So they are really difficult to judge exactly where they are around the corners and whatnot. Oh boy, we're injured. Yeah, we're really injured and we only have... Oof, we've got 15 tranks left. Uh... That's pretty bad. And of course, there's still another one left. Can we shoot these guys whilst they're on the floor? We can, but they kind of get straight back up. They take a shit ton to put down. They really do. Right, that's the last of the tranks. Yeah, we're in danger. We've got four left. Right, let's go back and get a food bar. Holy shit. I mean, we could just blast them with the gun, I guess. But, I mean, I did try and look up. Um, when I, I think I said a while ago in one of my videos. I did try and look up. Did we buy everything in this machine? Probably. Oh no, there is food there. Okay, cool. We can buy a food. I mean, honestly, why would you call... Uh, did you just call it... Like, did they even bother trying? What should we call this health snack bar here? Uh, I know! Let's call it food! Yeah. But then I guess, you know, the bottle's called bottle. I think the drink's called a <laughs> drink. So, yeah, alright, 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 fine. Um... Yeah, sound design is not this game's strong point at all. You really can't picture where the enemies are in relation to anything. Uh, right, pick stuff up. Please have Trank. Yes. Cool. Right, that's good. That's good. Alright, that's fine. And you can't really run away from these things either. And there's no amount of stun locking. Right, we're empty. We're empty. Reload. Come on. Keep this party wagon going. Get the fuck off my face. Oh, God. Uh, right, reload. Right, let's white cream him up. Oh god, here they come. I think a lot of these trank rounds actually miss as well. Oh good, fantastic. And you also get stuck on them. Unlike Resident Evil, you can't push your way through these guys. Which is really shit. I don't like that. Oh. Fuck right off, pal. Yeah, you can melt. Nobody cares about you. Really? A file? I shall read it if I must. Opening soon, the latest Beast Moon thriller. The Beast Moon Darkness. Does the final prophecy come true? Does the final battle between human... Oh, the final battle between human and, and beast begins. This series based on the actual prophecy. What prophecy? Does the door really open to the final prophecy? Announces retirement. Andy Jones' last picture. Right. 
Oh, Randy Jones. Okay, so he did the Beast Moon. The Beast Moon, Never Ending War. The Beast Moon, Seduced by Death. The Beast Moon, Despair. The Beast Moon, Entombed. Or Entombed. Yeah, Entombed. The Beast Moon, Reborn. The Beast Moon 7. They just fucking gave up there, didn't they? Uh, the Beast Moon, Castle of the Beast. And the Beast Moon 9, The Prophecy. Really? Ugh. I would have preferred that to be something of actual value instead of one of these. These files are ass. Can I say that? That these files, in the, in the words of Jimmy, are just anus? Like large quantities of, of anus. Alright, let's put that in there. Reload the pistol. Okay. Uh, my god, these tranquilizers. Oh, you, oh, the attractions key. Uh, right. What's this doodad here? There's a machine that makes lucky coins. Doesn't work, so the power's off. Right, what is all that about then? These lucky coins. Yeah, so as I as I was saying, I did try and look some information up on this game. Um, about... Uh, there is a door there. You know, uh, but just some hints and tips, some general things, and the big... Oh, God, what the hell is this? The biggest trouble with this game is there's no information about it online at all. There's one awfully written... Uh, yeah, one awfully written... Oh, we can go in here. Walk through. Uh, there's a tips page that doesn't really have any tips on it. Oh, what is this? Shh, this is shit. I'm seeing why this game was unfavorable uh, compared to Resident Evil. As I said before as well, this game came out like three years after Resident Evil. Where are we on the map? Oh, right. Okay. I guess we should probably go to the attractions room, but I'm kind of curious to see what's through here. Door locked to the evil house. I mean, what does this have to do? This isn't horror related. This is anus. But okay. Yeah, we'll hold on to that drink until we really need it. I, as far as I can tell, there's no real way to get around the enemies. You, you just gotta shoot and... It's not like Resident Evil where that you can duck and dive. Uh, the enemies seem to have like a huge... I mean... Huge hitbox to them when they go for an attack. Alright, let's go through here. Here's the thing, I can't hear anything in here. That doesn't mean there isn't anything in here. I do like the fact we can reload as many times as we want. In theory, we're just throwing all of our bullets on the floor in full magazines. Okay. Oh, we have some ominous music. Is that a door? Question mark. I mean, the game lags up when I try and search it. It's dark. I can't see it. You can't see anything. Okay. Dark. I can't see anything. Right, so I'm guessing we need to rest... Ooh, hello. Ooh! We have a werewolf, I guess. Good thing we brought the boomstick. This thing looks gribbly. Or, you know, maybe it isn't. Come on, you big, ugly, flea-ridden bastard. Six shotgun shells was that. Yeah. Alright, I thought he was going to be a lot worse than he was. <laughs> Alright, not bad. Yes. Not bad. Good thing we had the shotgun. We might 
run into issues if we have to fight more than one of those things at once. That's a very Resident Evil looking door. Oh, good. Hey, this is like a metal chick. I approve. Um, okay. Sorry, love, but I don't really want to kill you. I'm certainly not going to waste a shotgun shell on you. Door is... Oh, God. We're going to have to. I, I'm guessing we have to kill her. No, maybe not. Oh, bloody hell. Look at this shit. Uh, oh, man. There's so many of them. We've got no choice. I'm sorry, ladies. I kind of am. Oh, God. We're really up against it here. Yeah, I... Yeah, I know. I do want to try and save people where we can. But... I mean, it's just not always going to be possible, is it? There has to be something wrong with where I'm using the stun gun. There are some other walkthroughs online of this game. Oh, fucking hell. Now, I can actually hear him. Here we go. Come on, big boy. Hey, you should be stunned. There we go. Get out of my face, buddy. Don't want your fleas and ticks today. Oof. There's more. I like this shotgun. Now where's the next guy? Around the corner, isn't he? I'm guessing werewolves can't be saved? It'll be right around that corner. All right, Keith. Ready, buddy? Think. Dude, where you at? Where you at? Come on, Daddy. Come on. There we go. Boom! Oh, I like them. Is that two of them? No. Not sure whether shooting up in the heads? No. Shoot up in the head, you actually just, you know, miss them entirely. Of course. What was I expecting? Running out of shotgun. Really running out of shotgun here. Okay. Don't know if there's any more of these things. That door? Hmm. Not sure. Can't see. I mean, this is a hell of a bloody walkway, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it is. Really don't want to use a shotgun on anything less, really, than the gribbly uh, bastard werewolves. Okay. What's this? Shutters are closed. Can't go any further. Okay. Ah. Ooh. Different color. Anesthetic dark B. Okay, well, I'll tell you what sucks about that. I'm guessing that's more powerful, right? Which I think is fairly logical. The logical assumption. But. Oh. Can we not use that in this gun? No, we can. Okay, I'm not sure why it wouldn't reload. Maybe it was because it was trying to reload the standard rounds. Uh, but the trouble is, you get less than half of these. So, they're going to have to be significantly more, ooh, more powerful for it to be worth it. Have a yellow key. 
We have yes, thank you. And we have some juice. But the thing is, if all those bottles do is combine juice, is there any real point in them? I don't know, to be honest. Monitors and gauges have been installed. Yeah, we can see that. Right. Is there anything we can fondle? Uh, guess not. All right, okay. So what does that do? Museum key. Right, well, we, we have seen the museum. Not 100% sure where the museum is. At least I can't remember. Ah, no, 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 I think I do. I think I know, remember. Okay. Yeah, really not sure about these uh, more advanced, I guess they're more advanced, um, stun darts. As I said before, I mean, yeah, great, they're more powerful, but you get significantly less of them. Is that a worthwhile trade-off? Uh, I don't know. They're going to have to be really freaking powerful to be worth it. Okay, now where was the museum? And I'm, I'm thinking buying bottles ain't going to be worth it either. Hmm. Ah, oh, right. Ah, uh, yeah, so I think the museum was oh we've got a door going off one second guys <laughs> 